Hi, IASvideos.com is presenting you simplified daily current affairs analysis. Information Technology Act. Government can read your private emails, messages on your PC. Which agencies are authorized to snoop any computer? What is Section 69 of the Information Technology Act 2000? Who else is empowered to sanction such orders? What is the penalty for misrepresentation to the investigating agencies? When is tapping by the government lawful or illegal? GS Paper 2 – Government Policies and Schemes In this video, you can find detailed answers for all the above questions. The above article has been retrieved from IndianExpress.com, dated December 28, 2018. What we are providing here is just a 10% sample out of the full-length video. Visit our website IASvideos.com to join the course and to unlock all videos. We offer this pendrive course cash on delivery on Amazon.in too. Amazon will deliver our course to your doorstep. What is the context about? The Cyber and Information Security Division of the Ministry of Home Affairs on Thursday night issued a circular authorizing 10 central agencies to intercept, monitor and decrypt all the data contained in any computer system. A total 10 central probe and snoop agencies are now empowered under the Information Technology Act for computer interception and analysis. Which agencies are authorized to snoop any computer? The agencies empowered with intercepting information on any computer system in the country include the Intelligence Bureau, Necrotics Control Bureau, Enforcement Directorate, the Central Board of Direct Taxes, Directorate of Revenue Intelligence, Central Bureau of Investigation, National Investigation Agency, the Research and Analysis Wing, Directorate of Signal Intelligence and the Commissioner of Police, Delhi. What is Section 69 of the Information Technology Act 2000? This particular section of the said Act empowers the central or state government in the name of defense or security interests of the country to intercept or monitor or decrypt any information that it deems necessary or expedient to do in the interest of sovereignty or integrity of India. Who else is empowered to sanction such orders? The Union Home Secretary is also empowered to authorize or sanction the intelligence and security agencies for undertaking tapping and analysis of phone calls under the provisions of the Indian Telegraph Act. What is the penalty for misrepresentation to the investigating agencies? According to the order, the subscriber or service provider or any person in charge of the computer resource will be bound to extend all facilities and technical assistance to the agencies. Under the Act, those making any misrepresentation or trying to hide facts from the agency may get jail term for up to two years or with up to rupees one lakh or with. When is tapping by the government lawful or illegal? The code laid down safeguards. Tapping of telephones is prohibited without an authorizing order from the Home Secretary of the Union Government or of the State Government concerned. The order unless is valid for two months if renewed it cannot remain in operation beyond six months. Phone tapping or interception of communications must be limited to the addresses specified in the order or to the addresses likely to be used by the person specified in the order. All copies of the intercepted material must be destroyed as soon as their retention is not necessary under Section 5.2.